Welcome to Peter Play. We are playing The Legend of Zelda, but we are doing a different game right now. Uh, lastly, I finished Link's Awakening for the Nintendo Switch, and now we are going to dive into Skyward Sword for the Nintendo Switch. Uh, so this is going to be a new adventure uh, that I'm going to start a new game. It's also a port from the Wii, if I'm not mistaken, and it's the first Zelda game in the chronological order. So now we will find out how it all starts. Very excited to start this game so uh without further ado let's get it on so there we are the startup screen of legend of zelda link uh skyward sword i still have to like uh get used to the new things when playing with a joy con attach the strap by following the steps provided oh that's if you want to do motion control okay um am i gonna do motion control though wow this is a tale that you humans have passed down through uncounted generations. I have to be faster. Ooh, intro cutscene. It tells of a war of unmatched scale and ferocity, the likes of which would never be seen again. Ominous, ominous. Ooh. One dark, fateful day, the earth cracked wide and malevolent forces rushed forth from the fissure. a brutal assault upon the surface people driving the land into deep despair you gotta love these cutscenes they are so detailed so good they burned forests to ash choked the land sweet springs and murdered without hesitation Ooh, the war trumpets right there you gotta love the attention to detail right in their lust to take the ultimate power protected by her grace the goddess Ooh. okay the power she guarded was without equal interesting handed down by the gods of old this power gave its holder the means to make any desire a reality interesting such was the might of the ultimate power that the ones placed it, uh, they, they placed it in the care of the goddess to prevent this great power from falling into the hands of evil swarming the lands. What a cut scene, what an intro. The goddess gathered the surviving humans on an outcropping of earth. What a cutscene. She sent it skyward, beyond the reach of the demonic hordes, beyond even the clouds. Okay. Humans saved, the goddess joined forces with the land dwellers and fought the evil forces, sealing them away. Okay. At last, peace was restored to the surface. What an introduction. This is a tale that you humans have told for many ages, generation to generation. Okay. But there are other legends long hidden away from memory that are intertwined with this tale. Okay. Now, a legend bound to this great story stands ready to be revealed. The epicness of it all. You, you gotta love it. You gotta love it. A legend that will be forged by your own hand. By playing the game. Yes, indeed. Wow. What an introduction. They know how to make a start. Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword. Yeah, let's place, press A to start. HD. Skyward Sword HD. Pardon me. What did you do? Save. What? That was too fast. Uh, but I'm not playing with motion control, so I'm kind of hoping that I can somehow... Um, all right. So, no adventure. Uh... How do I do options? Ah, there we have options. So, control mode. Button only controls. Right. All right, cool. 
so let's go back now oh that, that that's the sky world right so yeah okay now it's working now it's working so new adventure top game right link is fine for me i am not going to be too adventurous so let's go to the okay button wow and another intro cutscene but this looks to be game graphics right hello Ooh. you you look positively huge is that like uh that's monstrous in size is that like a sneak peek of the end boss because then i need loads of hearts <laughs> loads of them nintendo presents what do you the legend of zelda that's what you present skyward sword all right i can hear the wind jumping off of the ledge because of, ah because they is jumping to their birds okay uh these are very bright graphics i hope they're not burning your eyes again you gotta love the music in these games it's so good it's so good that mysterious lady that we cannot see her face is that is that the zelda of this game uh, and that would be then the link of this game <laughs> okay am i going to have to face the boss straight out of the i mean that's not fair is it Rise, Link. The time has come for you to awaken. No, no, no. Link's Awakening is a different game. I, I finished that one. No, different game. You are mistaken. <laughs> you are fated to have a hand in a great destiny and it will soon find you. The time has come for you to awaken. All right. Okay. Let's 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 just leave it at that. I will I will have to awaken. Link. There is one of those birds. <laughs> okay. So, Link in this game has psychological problems because he's got very vivid nightmares. Guilty conscience, maybe. Who knows? So, it appears he just fell out of bed. And there's a bird staring. <laughs> all right, all right. The bird was given a letter to deliver, so that's how birds do it. They just spit it out in your face. So Link is now holding a letter, drowning in bird spit. Hey, sleepyhead, I know how much you like to sleep in, so I'm guessing this letter will be your alarm clock this morning. Did I guess right? I guess you did. Rise and shine, Link. Today's the wing ceremony, whatever that is. You promised to meet me before it starts, remember? No, because I am fresh into this game. You'd better keep me waiting. You'd better not keep me waiting. And it is Zelda. All right, cool. So we have to meet Zelda. <laughs> right, so... Am I in control now? I am. I can walk around. Ah, so, okay, I'm pressing all the buttons to see how stuff works. So that doesn't do nothing. Ah, so if I uh, hold R and then do the right Joy-Con, it's actually left and the right Joy-Con, then I can look around. If I press ZL, then I center the camera around me and the, the left Joy-Con controls Link. Open the door with A. Fine, so I'm out of my room. Cool. Hold L. Oh, so now they're now they're teaching me all this. Alright, cool. So uh I wanna I wanna get back into my room actually because maybe I was too fast in, in getting out. 
I know I have to get to Zelda, but let's check my own room first. Can I open closets, like, for example? I can. <laughs> I found a blue rupee. It's worth five rupees. You better drop it in your wallet for now. But that was in my closet. That was mine already, right? Uh, so how... how... Sit? What, what's the point of sitting? Uh, let's, let's not sit. Can I open that? That's my bed. Okay, so I think, I think, am I, am I done here? More rupees to find? I have to remember to press the L to get the camera to where I wanted to go. Okay, so I think I'm done in this room. I found five rupees already. Oh, and I didn't check. Uh, I have one, two, three. I have six hearts. That's double the amount that I started with. Ooh, another guy. So I'll talk to you. A bit. Morning, Link. Hello. So today is the wing ceremony. Again, I guess so. Are you ready? I don't know, because I don't know what the wing ceremony is. All I'm saying is everyone else is out there practicing at the plaza, but you seem pretty relaxed about the whole thing. Because I am such a relaxed dude. Of course, that crimson loft wing of yours is something special. I'd feel pretty confident riding him too, I know. My bird won the last ceremony, but even I don't think he could beat that red terror of yours. Of course, a bird... True speed in a race always comes down to the skill of the rider. That would be me. I'm something of a bird researcher around here, so you know, if you have ever find yourself in need of some bird experience, come see old Pippet. Okay. Now I'll, I'll go see the other old guy right there. I've got the... the somehow I want to use the other, uh, like, analog stick to control the camera. That doesn't work. So let's talk to you. Hey, Link. Owlan. Whoever Owlan is. The day of the wing ceremony is finally upon us. Oh. He looks to be excited. Well, at least the voice, the, <laughs> the face is pretty calm. Uh, it's time to put what you've learned to use. All those practical skills I taught you and the academic prowess instructor Horwell taught you. Who is Horwell? <laughs> While we're at it, do you remember how to look around using... No. Okay, let's try. Ah, and then you can also look around. I'm... I'm... I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you in your eyes. Um, okay. So, okay. And how do you, you press that button again? Oh, and then the camera is is stopping for it, basically. All right, cool. So, anything that I can take from here? Like paper, books, rupees? Yeah, I know that, that rupees are pretty... Ah! So, if you give the game the room then the camera will actually adjust itself to link if not not all right any books that i can read here so no okay so that was my room i think yep fledge who is fledge but fledge is not there okay uh whose room was this gruz gruz is not there Colin and Colin and who? Stritch. None of them are there. <laughs> and there's a dude trying to 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 lift. Uh, all right, let's talk to you. <laughs> oh, what? Look at the cheeks. Ah, this is Fletch. So that's why Fletch is not in his room. Good morning, Link. Today's the big wing ceremony, right? Yeah, everybody tells me so. I wanted to fly too. Ah, so it's about flying. But I didn't make the cut, so I'm stuck here, back here at the academy. Plus, I've got to move those barrels over to the kitchen. I was hoping at least to be able to cheer you on, Link, but I guess that's the way it goes. Go out there and wow them, buddy. But can I pick up these? Oh, pots, pots. Can I destroy pots and find rupees? Pick it up. All right, so now, now I get this. Okay, so... Uh, so obviously you can't just carry it. You have to lift it over your head. And I have like this... Uh, this... Uh, what is it? A stamina wheel or something? <laughs> Alright, so I'll put it down for a sec. Ah, and then it refills. Okay, cool. So pick it back up. And then walk it to the kitchen, to that person. Why do you lift it over your head? You can just... Maybe that's the best thing for your back. I don't know. Can I put it on you? <laughs> can I? Can I? <laughs> No. What's all this? I thought I told Fletch to carry that. Bah, probably for the best. That skinny boy would probably have gotten flattened. Probably. Say, didn't you have some important ceremony today? Well, thanks for the help. 
That's it. That's it. Thanks for the help. You're not giving me anything. Can I, can I like, take stuff from your kitchen? Can I? Okay, I can't. Uh, how do I get out of here? Like there. Okay, so there were pots here as well. Can I pick up the pots? Yes. Put down. Ah, okay. What was this? Restroom. Really? <laughs> There's a restroom. All right. So, what can I do in the restroom? <laughs> sit. <laughs> I can go sit. Um, do put your pants... Well, okay. Um, discussion there. Because it's a game, maybe also for children. If Link puts his pants down, we might see some inappropriate things, but... <laughs> Now he's, got to, he's just gonna soil himself like this, right? <laughs> he's falling asleep on... Okay, let's let's move. Let's move. <laughs> oh, lovely, lovely. The sound, the sound. Um, so he did he did soil himself, basically. So here's the door that... Oh, there's a staircase. So I'll check the door later. Uh, at first, I'll... I'll, I'll mm. Oh, yeah, yeah. I went there. I went there. Hey! Ah, uh, Pippet. Jesus. If you're heading over to the plaza, the quickest way out is the door on the ground floor. The exit on the top floor is still locked, so you obviously can't get out there. What's taking lunch lady so long? I'm going to have to work with her later. Yeah, ask... Uh, what's his name? Fletch. <laughs> ask Fletch. So, this door is gonna be locked. Oh no, Headmaster Gaypora. Gaypora, Gaypora. He's not in, is he? Is that... that looks to be... Uh, a library that I can do nothing with. Like, huge books, by the way. Huge books. Uh, no, 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 no. And that's it. Okay. So, yes, I am taking my time to explore. And then we have... So, nobody's at home. Oh, this is... Oh, okay, no Zelda. No Zelda. Uh, no instructor Horwell and who is this because I skipped this door instructor Owlin ah but I saw him downstairs so obviously not there and I saw somebody up here hello and you are Hi. ah Karane or Karain or whatever please let me know in the comments how do I pronounce these names good morning Link good luck in the wing ceremony today just think if you win today you'll become a senior like us and you'll be a very big step closer to graduating as a knight. So you're a knight. Or almost. You'll even get a knight uniform like I'm wearing. Something tells me you'll be pretty handsome in it. But still not as dreamy as him. Oh, you got a crush on someone. And is this a second restroom? It's the bath. And okay, I can't do anything with that. So. Right, right. Something in the pots. Can I pick up the... Oh, you can't throw them. Oh. All right, let's get ourselves wet. There we go. Clothing and everything. I don't know if it does anything except make me wet. Uh, all right, let's go. Let's go. So then this door is supposed to be supposedly locked. And it is. Okay, cool. So I think I've seen it all then. Skyloft map. North, Statue of the Goddess. East, Residential Quarter. South Plaza, West Knight Academy. Okay. Uh, so I will go back down then. Is there a way to run? <laughs> Not down the stairs, apparently. <sighs> Thanks, that was a huge help, Link. I moved the barrel. Yes. So how many rupees do I have? 25. All right. Thanks for wishing me luck with whatever the wing ceremony is. So I'm out of here. And now I'm outside. Loft. So this is the, the island in the sky. All right, cool. And that's where I'm at. Okay, and what is this? Examine. Yes, please. Well, I need to get used to the controls, obviously. Bird statue. Oh, I can use it to save a game. 
I've got some rupees, so let's save it already. Select the file. New adventure. Yes, please. Save to this file. Yes, please. Uh, okay, the sounds are cool. Hey! <laughs> hey! <laughs> it's, the, it's the same in every Zelda game, is it? Very short words and they mean a lot. Hey, Link, up here. Where up there? Oh. Yo! Yo! <laughs> Yo, <laughs> he just said yo. Good morning to you, Link. Today's finally the day of the long-awaited wing ceremony. Are you feeling ready? Oh, I just remembered. There's something I'd like to ask you about. Target me and we can have a quick chat. Target, how do you target? Aim at your target and old CL. Uh, how do you aim at the target, though? Uh, so maybe I have to look at the target and then hold CL. Ooh. Okay. Always remember you can target someone to talk to them easily. And even if there isn't anything to target, it's a convenient way to quickly face your view forward. Yeah, I figured as much. Okay. Oh, but it's a little silly to carry on a conversation from a distance. Why don't you come join me up here? Oh, so I have to climb up there. Yeah, you should be able to climb if you use dash uh, to the top. Of okay. Then you can make that jump fairly easily. Try climbing up there. Dash while moving hold B. Okay. Hit. All right, then he ought oh, <laughs> my bad. He automatically jumps if you do that. All right, these controls are tricky though. Uh, no, don't target that. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna get. I'm. I'm gonna get. Uh, I'm gonna have to get used to these controls. All right, so. Yo. Yo, he says yo again. So what are you up to? Rushing to get some last minute bird riding practices in, the, in this morning, Link? Probably. Oh, you have something, someone to meet? Ah, Zelda's waiting for you, is she? Perfect timing then. See Zelda's father, Headmaster Gaypora? Oh, I've been in his office. Has a pet named Mia. And well, she's scampered off again. And she's where? Look. Oh, she's on, ah, on the roof of that building. Wow. Do you see her? The headmaster's busy working with Zelda preparing for the ceremony. I thought uh, maybe I could feed her, but the ceremony is about to start and I just put on a fresh set of clothes and, well, you see. Will you help me get... Yeah, okay, I'm on it. Ooh. Fantastic, so you'll do it. I'll know you're in a hurry, so I'll really appreciate you taking the time to help. You should be able to climb up over there somewhere. If you hang off that ledge there, you can climb onto the roof from the other side. What ledge? I know you're a quite client. Okay, he appreciates it. So ah, that ledge. Okay, so uh, okay, and now I can move. Let go. No, I'd rather not. <laughs> now I can let go. Face my view forward. Make that jump, and then this is this climbable? <laughs> yes, it is. All right, cool. Uh, what is this? Ah, interesting. Uh, I don't know what it is, but it's something. Um, so I need to get up there. Ah, but maybe I can move this. You're right. Hey, move. And then... Yeah, why don't you move it? Ah, because I have to hold it longer. That's why. Oh, look, there's a dome of clouds there. Once I gain the ability to fly, I should, I should visit that, right? Uh, so now I should dash. And now I'm on the roof. And there we have Pet Mia. Pick it up. Put it down. No, I won't. I'll uh, I'll just jump down. No fall damage. That's cool. I think it was over here somewhere, right? There we go. Ooh. Nice work. You've brought her back safe and sound. Yes, I did. I'm awesome. Sorry for troubling you with this. I know you're busy, Link. I suppose I should feed Mia now. Yes, and give me rupees. Please tell the headmaster that we found his pet. He should be up with the statue of the goddess. Give me rupees, man. I climbed a roof for you. I believe Zelda is there with him, so you should hurry along. Oh, yes, I should give you a reward. It's not much, but please take this. Don't tell the others. So that's 45 rupees, right? I'm getting rich. I'm not gonna save. Uh, I'll save later. That looks like... Oh! Oh! 
Jackamar. Jackhammer. <laughs> Jackamar. <laughs> nice. Is it me or does he resemble Sylvester Stallone? Anyway, morning Link, how's life? Did you manage to get even a wink of sleep last night? Figured you might have been tossing and turning all night thinking about the big ceremony today. What am I doing? Oh, just fixing this gate here. It's been squeaky lately and we can't have that on the day of the ceremony, okay? If you haven't forgotten to send your prayers to the goddess this morning, have you? Just face your bird statue over there and say a short prayer to save your progress. Figure that, figure that. As you know, those bird statues are all over Skyloft. It's about time you get in the habit of stopping at a statue every time you run by one. A prayer in time saves nine, if you know what I'm saying. All right, and what is this? A stamina fruit. This peculiar fruit replenishes your stamina. God, a gouge. It's a, it's a gouge. It's not a stamina wheel. It's a gouge. Well, running. Ah, that's why you need these. And uh, oh, cutscene. So I've done very little, but we're 25 minutes into this episode already. A lot of cutscenes here. going to interrupt the song. Good morning, Link. Hello. I'm glad to see my loft wing got you out of bed. Yeah. I was pretty sure you'd sleep in and forget to meet me this morning. <laughs> but look at this instrument and look at this outfit. They're mine to use today in the ceremony since I'll be playing the role of the goddess. Why am I not surprised? Aren't they beautiful, especially this instrument? They tell me it's just like the one the goddess was said to have in the legends. It sounds gorgeous too. I asked father about it and he says it's called a harp. All right, so it's a harp. And look at these clothes. I made this wrap myself and we get to use it in today's ceremony. Between the harp and this outfit, I'm going to make a great goddess today. Well, if you say so yourself. I got up early this morning because I wanted you to be the first to see me like this link. Ooh la la, love is in the air. So how do I look? <laughs> okay. So I can say great. I can say nice costume. I can say, ah, uh, <laughs> I think I'll be, I'll be, I'll be friendly right now, right? Ah, I think so too, but it's nice to know you agree. Thanks, Link. Ooh. <laughs> He's putting his belly forwards. Okay. Ah, there you are, Zelda. Are you all prepared for today's ceremony? Oh, it's Kaipura, so let's take a look at the Kaipura. Oh, hello, father. So, there we have him. Ah, Link, you're here too. Outstanding. It's encouraging to see you up so early, given your capacity for sleep. Wow, look at the brow. It's... The biggest unibrow I've ever seen. <laughs> no doubt today's ceremony had you were too excited to close your eyes for once. No, no, I got waken up quite rudely. If you win today's ceremonial race, you'll get to participate in the post-race ritual with Zelda. Um, what is that supposed to mean? <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? So give it your best out there. Okay. Yes, about that. Father, I don't know if he can do... What? <laughs> what? Recently, Link hasn't been practicing much at all for the ceremony. And even when he's out riding his loft wing, he's just lazily gliding around, probably daydreaming. I don't know what he's thinking. He's going to have to be in perfect control of his bird to win today. Uh, excuse me? Excuse me? No need to worry yourself, Zelda. Yeah, look at him scratching his head. Ever, ever heard of inspiring confidence in people? This is not the way to do it. Uh, though you, though you may have a point, today's wing ceremony tests the skill of the rider as well as his bond with the bird. Victory will not come easy, easily. And as you pointed out, I haven't seen him practicing as hard as some of the other students. But you've known him since you were both very little. You should know better than to fret about him. Yes, you should. You should. You see, Link and his loft wing share a special connection. I've never seen anything quite like it. Okay. And now we're all looking to the sky. As you know, each of us in Skyloft is but one half of a pair. We are only made whole by our loft wings, the guardian birds that the goddess bestows upon each of us as a symbol of her divine protection. Really, so they all have a bird. Poor bird that has to carry Master Gaypora because he looks positively heavy. <laughs> uh, when we are young, every one of us meets our loft wing under the great statue of the goddess. It's quite a big moment, as I'm sure you'll recall. 
Ah, uh, but that first meeting between Link and his Loftwing was extraordinary, was it? What happened? <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Okay, my, my, my mind is going in weird places. Let's continue with the text. Uh, the bird came to him. The bird that came to him was a crimson loftwing. It's a breed so rare we were sure for some time that it had vanished from the line. Okay. Yes, and the boy and his bird seemed to share a profound connection from the moment they met. Do you recall when Link and that loftwing of his first met? What a sight. The little boy just hopped on that bird and gracefully flew away without even a moment of instruction. They were meant for each other. And judging by how chalice you were that day, yes, Zelda, you were chalice. I say the friendship he shared with his bird didn't go unnoticed by you too, my dear. Ah, Link is reliving the magical moments and I can see right up his nose. <laughs> uh, why is he doubting? Ah, but who can blame you? I'm sure you weren't the only one envious of the powerful bond shared by Link and his bird. <laughs> Link... <laughs> Okay, sorry, I'm thinking along the wrong lines here. Anyone who is part of something special is bound to catch some nasty look sooner or later. Ho ho. <laughs> this contest is nothing to laugh at, Father. The ceremony is part of the final test for those training to become Knights of Skyloft. If Link doesn't fly fast enough during the race... What if Link messes up his big chance? Well, what if he's not allowed to become a knight? Then I'll be something else. Like, uh, I don't know. Calm down, my dear. It'll be fine. Oh, so I got, I got like the headmaster on my side. So it's like a, it's stooged. I've already won this race. That's cool. Honestly, it's almost as though you become a completely different person when you worry about Link. Yes, because she's in love. Hey. Listen, Link, you'd better fly your heart out today. No, because then I'm dead. At the very least, you need to squeeze in a little practice time before the race. Come on, you'll thank me later. All right, so Zelda is dragging me to the edge of Skyloft. Here we are. Now go on, jump off the edge and call your Loftwing. It's almost time for the ceremony, so try practicing seriously for once. Fine, I'll fly. Oh yeah, you can't sense your bird out there? Oh, I get it. You're trying to weasel out of having to practice. Nice try, but you're not fooling me. Off you go. And she just... You killed me, woman. You just pushed me off the ledge. I didn't do that. The game did that by itself. <laughs> They're just staring at me falling to my death. <laughs> hmm, his bird sure is taking a long time to get here. Something's wrong. Yeah, if you see how fast that bird came along, something is wrong indeed. In there, Link, I got you. I can see that. Like a sack of potatoes, I'm flown back to Skyloft. Oh. Are you two alright? No, your daughter just pushed me to my death off the edge. I'm sorry, friend. I didn't mean to push you so hard. I didn't sprain your wing, did you didn't sprain your wing, did you? So you pushed me off the ledge. That's totally fine. I almost died. That's totally fine. But the bird, the poor bird. <laughs> this is very odd, Link. What could have possibly happened to your loftwing? I couldn't sense it. I told you. For a bird to ignore, ignore the call of his master, it's unheard of. And you still can't sense your bird nearby, eh, Link? Eh, Link? This is quite a problem, especially considering the wing ceremony is about to start. Link, when you said you couldn't sense your loftwing well, I should have believed you. Yes, I'm sorry. Finally, an apology. But yes, if I tell you something, you believe me. That's that's how we're going to do it from this day forward, right? I talk to you, you listen. <laughs> no? <laughs> okay. I need to tend to my own loftwing. Really, really. I just had a heart attack. Probably peed myself, but I guess I'm fine. So I'll catch up with you later. Yeah, I guess I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> You'd better go on ahead and see if you can find where your bird has gone. Oh, the bells are ringing. Ah, you can even see them ringing. Okay. Ooh. My, how did it get to be so late? Because your daughter pushed me off the, off the ledge. Yes, I'm not letting it go. If you recall correctly, this year Instructor Horrell is presiding over the ceremony. Link, you should go explain the situation to him and see if he's willing to delay the race a little so you can find your bird. I just nod. I'm the silent hero. 
<laughs> but, but father, you're the headmaster of the academy. If Link asks Instructor Horwell, he'll probably just come talk to you about it. Oh, oh. <laughs> I'm gonna try that in real life and see if people get what I mean. Ah, quite true. As usual, you make an excellent point, my dear. Very well, I'll explain the situation to him myself. Link, run along to Instructor Horwell to see me in my quarters. All right. Um, but these are some very lengthy uh, cutscenes, so hello. Can I talk to you? I'm going to tend to my bird and make sure he's not hurt. I'll catch up with you later. Go, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fine, 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 fine. You don't care about me. I get it, I get it. Can I walk around here somewhere? Stuff to discover. Uh, if I if I get to a statue, this being one of them, but absolutely too big. If I get to a bird statue, I'm gonna I'm gonna save because these are some pretty lengthy uh, lengthy cutscenes. Ah, there was a bird statue down here, right? By Mr. Jackhammer. Uh, ah, another speech balloon. So okay, let's talk to him. Is something wrong? Yes, I almost died. I'm not letting it go. I told you. <laughs> the big hurry. What your loft wing is missing? Yes, it is missing. But I just saw him. Gruus's bird was chasing off after your feathered fella. Uh, uh, which way? Where's Gruus? Ah, uh, tough choice, us. Um, which way? <laughs> wow, <laughs> he needs to think a lot on that. Well, to be honest, I don't really recall. Ah, oh, I should have picked the other one. Can I? Can I redo? Can I try? Oh, Gruz and his little cronies were saying they were headed down to the wing ceremony in the plaza. Are you still trying to get down south end? Ah, okay, that's where the plot. Okay, 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 okay. So I need I need to go around. Fine. Ah, it's the same thing. So minus brings out the map, plus brings out the inventory. Uh, but I can't see my rupees. But I have like the wallet. I have a rupee wallet there, but I can't see what the rupee wallet does. Small wallet. I don't. Okay, fine. Let's let's not worry about that now. Was there not a bird statue here? Ah, yes, obviously, but the bird statue was down there. Right. So... Yo! Yo! He always says yo. What's wrong, Link? You're looking a little pale. What? Your loft wing is missing? How strange and troubling. Do you think you can find him? I don't know. Uh, you're going to start looking for him now? How will you make it back in time to fly for the ceremony? It looks like your participation of the ceremony hinges on a feather. Oh, nice one. Or not, if you can find that bird in time. Excuse me. I see, so the headmaster has summoned me? Yes, 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 yes. Uh, I'll go speak with him immediately. I still owe you for helping me out earlier, so don't worry about the ceremony for now. You focus on finding your loft wing. Nice. <sighs> don't men open doors for ladies anymore? How long am I supposed to stand here for a little... How long am I supposed to stand here waiting for a little chivalry? Ugh. Oh, it's you, Link. Say, you look all flustered. Did something happen? Jesus, how many times do I need to explain? Yes, I can't find the loft wing. No, I've been at school the whole time. All right. Um, a bird statue right there. I'll save. All right, cool. So uh, I'll have to go around through the academy or can I just jump? I can. No fall damage. That's cool. Uh, or... Did I make a mistake doing that? Maybe I should enter the academy. People might be there that I can talk to, right? We are running for 39 minutes. Uh, so the first episode is going to be a long one. So Fletch is there again. Do you know about my loft wing? Again, again, the explanation. Yeah, the bird. It's missing. Huh? So he knows something. No, 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 no. You know something, boy. Hey, kitchen lady. I'm back. <laughs> yes, I'm talking to you. All right. 
My kitchen lady. Oh, kitchen lady. Um, there was another dude here, right? That one. Hmm. You're not still wandering around the academy, are you? No, you're seeing a mirage. I'm not here. <laughs> Why would a guardian bird not go? I don't know, because it's missing. Uh, you've never heard of it happening before. Okay, but you're the bird connoisseur. You told me. All right, I'll go to the plaza. Clear hint. Uh, is the older dude, the elder dude, is still here? Yeah. What's hmm? What's wrong, Link? Your bird won't. Yes. Yes, I have. Wow. Everybody's just gonna delay the ceremony for me. Yeah, I'm going through the text quite quickly um, because yeah, it's taken a lot of time. So. Oh, so where is the door? Ah, oh, yeah, that, that way. Okay. So I think I spoke to everybody. Everybody is telling me to go to the plaza. So plaza it is. Plaza it is. Our birdie birdie. A little kid to talk to. What are you doing? The plaza can wait. Hold up, Link. Hey, hey, Link. Yeah, that's me. Could you help me with something? All you have to do is dash and roll into a tree. Just like I've been doing. Dash, then when you're in front of the tree, bam, they will roll right into it. So come on, please. How do you do that? While dashing, press L. Uh, excuse me? Ah. Uh, press L. That's, that's this button, so I just run. Huh. Ah, press L. So it's, it's, it's pressing down on the control, probably. Right. So yeah. All right. Okay. Right. You did it. A sky stag beetle. Wait up. Yeah, no beetle for you. Um, oh, hard flowers. Can I pick one of these? All right, cool. Uh, this would probably be the plaza, right? Yeah, I'm looking at the plaza. Who are you? Hi. Hi, Keith. Hi, Link. How's it going? The wing ceremony is about to begin, right? Remember when Pippet won the last one right in the last second? It was so close. Now that was a race. Your Crimson Loftwing will be in the race, right? No. Because it's missing. Oh, oh, oh. All right. You know, Gruz, that sure was a pain with... All that scratching and picking. Ah, now we're gonna find out where the Loftwing is. Of course it was. You thought a big crimson Loftwing like that was gonna go down without a fight. And the music. The music is just so great in this game. I can't say that enough. But we got him. And I don't care how tough these birds are supposed to be. He's not getting out of that pen anytime soon, boys. I think we met the villain of the story, right? Right there with the, with the lovely hair. And his sidekicks. Link, so yeah, just how long have you been standing there? <laughs> What's your problem anyway? Oh wait, I've got it. You're here to talk about today's race. I can see it in those dopey eyes of yours. You're one to talk. They're all pleading. Oh, Gruz, can you please find it in your heart to let me win today, please? You're just desperate to win so you can get some alone time with Zelda up on the statue of the goddess at the end of the ceremony. And meanwhile, he's just walking around with his yellow lips. <laughs> Well, sorry, pal. Cruz doesn't do charity for wimps. My advice, work hard and wish with all your heart. You might even come in second. Ooh? Say, come to think of it. How come I don't see your bird? Where is that scruffy pile of feathers? I can't imagine what would have happened to him. Do you think his tiny brain got confused by all the clouds and got lost? Ah, uh, yeah, too good to pass up. <laughs> you let off my do right now or I'll flatten you. Everyone knows I've got the slickest pompadour in town. <laughs> you know, 
we're all getting tired of, of you never let everyone forget you and Zelda go way back. Sickest pompadour in town, right? You've been friends since you were kids, big deal. It doesn't change the fact that you float through life with your head in the clouds. Would you wake up, straighten up and grow a backbone already? Dopes like you are dragging our honored academy through the mud. All right. And just whom? Ooh, Zelda's coming in to save the day. Uh. Oh. Oh. Oh, Zelda, hey. Ah, uh, nah, it's, uh, <laughs> nice. Oh. It just pushes me out of the way. Oh, the finger pointing in this game is awesome. Don't even try it, Groose. You're picking on Link again, aren't you? He's a student at the academy like all of us. Oh. Why do you insist on bullying him around so much? Yeah, I suppose. Mm -hmm. You suppose? Suppose what? Ah, Cruz is in love. I just suppose you are... <laughs> nah. Nah. Forget it, it was supposing any... I wasn't supposing anything, okay? <laughs> We're out of here, boys. Later, Link. Hope you find your bird or else you're gonna have to sit out today's race. That would be a major setback to our knighthood, knighthood, so find that bird or get real used to the taste of failure. It's your special flavor. <laughs> and then they're flying off on their birds, right? Yeah. I hate to say it, but I'm beginning to suspect those blockheads had something to do with your loved one's disappearance. You're beginning to suspect it? I think I'm quite certain they do, <laughs> but fine. Those guys aren't going to help us find your bird, so we'd better start searching. I'll fly around Skyloft and see if I can spot any trace of your bird. And I'll do... Father said he talked to Instructor Howell about delaying the start of the wing ceremony, so don't worry, we'll find your bird in time. And then they're all jumping off, rubbing it in that I don't have a bird. And I need to do what exactly? Just just wait or... Oh! Now I have to talk to you. Oh. What's wrong, Link? Uh, the bird is gone. The bird is gone. Yes, the bird is gone. We all know. The bird is gone. No, you, you haven't seen him, obviously. Why don't you look by the statue of the goddess? You'll have a few... Okay, okay, okay. So now they're sending me back to the statue of the goddess. All right, all right. I think I'm gonna do another save. That's what I'm gonna do. Because there's a lot of cutscenes in what I still think is the introduction. I've been playing 33 minutes already. Yes, save. Right, there we are. So, given that this episode has already gone on for just shy of 48 minutes, uh, I think I'm going to split the introduction into at least two parts, depending how long it is, and say goodbye for now. I will catch you in the next one as we continue the hunt for our loft wing, because that could be the key phrase of this episode. My bird is gone. So thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing to the channel, liking the videos, and leaving your comments below, and I will catch you in the next one. Goodbye.